Today, we're going to turn this hairless idiot into a bug killing machine. I currently only do one damage per hit. But after I kill one, I get whatever these silver circle things are. And with those, I can level him up. So he's now level three. And now I do more damage. I'm doing about three times as much damage as before. Gosh, that was disgusting. But survival experts say that protein is vital. That's true. So it's time to level you up some more because you're going to be eating a lot of bugs today. We're now doing seven damage every single click. We're killing them in actually three hits now. Oh, yeah. He says he really misses his wife and kids, but you're never going back to them. So don't worry about it. Just keep killing bugs. You're going to be eating them for uh, the rest of your life. We're now killing bugs in uh, one to two hits. It's pretty amazing. We're getting three stones every time we kill them. So at this point, we just want to keep leveling up. Unfortunately, I don't think he's ever going to grow any chest hair. But at least these bugs can't handle my stick. Once I become stronger, I'll be able to challenge the mother of trilobites. Okay, what the heck does that mean? I'm not really sure. But let's just keep leveling up at this point. I think it's all we can do. Oh, wait. I can now fight the mother of trilobites after getting to level 14. So let's click on the boss and go to battle. Uh-oh. Wait, so I just gotta click. Dude, I'm way strong. Wait, can I get this stick behind her? No, I bet I have to beat her and I win. I get a lot of money or stones rather. And then hopefully I get the stick. Look at a T1 club. So now I can equip the T1 club and I've got 444 more damage. That's a lot better than my stick I was using before. And now I am fighting a frog. Hello, frog. Take that. Oh, I kill him at one hit. So now I'll be making frogs extinct on this island. It's really easy killing these frogs in one hit and I'm getting a lot of experience for it. But the game really wants me to level up so i should probably listen to him let's just spam the level up button it takes me all the way to level 24 and i can now fight the goliath frog i, I should do that now that i'm goku or maybe it's oh wait it took away my fire okay we just destroyed that frog so quickly we shoved that big stick up its toad bum what's that mark on the ground is that a dinosaur print i don't know purchase a chest to get some gear okay how much is it oh i can get one for free well that's really convenient thank you developer you got some rags is what it looks like yeah tree pants they're gonna give me a lot of strength and hp though so i'm definitely gonna equip them so now i'm a lot stronger hello boar Oh, I'm actually kicking him now. Do you see that? I kicked him instead of uh, shoving the stick at his face. Come on. I want to see a kick again. Where is it? There it is. <laughs> it's kicked him right in the eyeball. We're killing the warthogs in one hit, which is good. And each one is giving me about 12 stones. There's a thunderbolt on the left side. Thor's might stage five. I think I'm currently stage three, but can I actually collect these? Oh, I can. Ooh, I just got 20 gems. I can purchase a chest for 10 gems each. So let's get one. We get a, it looks like a tree cap is what I'm guessing. Let's open another chest. And we got some, whatever those are. Well, let's equip them. We're going to put the tree cap on my head. It gives me 333 strength and then we got some i guess these are tree gloves another 305 strength so i'm definitely looking like a real warrior and i now kill the warthogs with one smack look at that except when i kick them it only does except when i kick them it doesn't kill them in one hit excuse me you hairless idiot just use your club all the time and you'll kill them instantly see see how easy that is just stop kicking them i now have 421 stones so i'm just gonna level up a lot take me all the way up to level 37 i can now fight the bro warthog I'm guessing I'll be able to kill him pretty easy. Let's see. So the green bar is my health. The red is his health. And that was a very easy victory. What is this on the ground over here? <gasps> A new helmet. I'm actually going to get some hair and not be looking like an idiot. Oh, but now I'm fighting Velociraptors. Uh-oh. Well, before I fight him, I think I should equip whatever it's telling me to equip here. A primitive bro wig. I get 2.2% critical attack. So I guess I'm going to use it because I at least have some hair now. And a bunch more buttons just unlocked. What's this? Get a random amount of gems for watching an ad. Okay, 10 to 1,000. I will watch an ad. And we get... <gasps> Wait, are you serious? Only 10? Oh my gosh, we got scanned. All right, you know what? We're gonna open a chest anyway. We got whatever that is. Looks like a rope of some sorts. Oh, it's tree pauldrons. Great, we now have these little string shoulder pads. Those should help us a lot. We're at least killing velociraptors in two hits. Ooh, that was a nice little critical strike there. But I need a new weapon. I'm sick of this wooden club. I can also get more gems from adventuring and murdering animals. And with those 30 gems, I'm gonna open more chests. This time we get some tree pants. I think we already have have those let's see what we get next another tree club that's a scam and more tree gloves okay well we're now starting to get duplicates can we actually sell the ones that we already have what about upgrading i need tree weapon materials so well i thought i had two of them no worries let's just get back to killing velociraptors we got our power up goku or ara thing we love it when that happens it's becoming increasingly clear that we need a lot of these stone donut thingies in order to level up so in these situations i bring out my auto clicker i set 
set this to 10. And then we let the game click for me. After beating on Velociraptors for about 10 minutes, I have 10.06A. That basically means 10,000 of these stone donuts. So I'm just going to do a lot of leveling up here. Let's actually run the auto clicker to level up. Oh yeah, listen to that. I love that sound. Okay, so I'm now level 131. Pretty sure I can uh, one-shot these Velociraptors and ruin the population. I also have a new civilization. So let's do some research. I am writing into my book. And, ooh, I've got grass. So I can now craft grass gear. All right then, and I get two chests. Are they gonna give me some new gear? Let's see, I have a bag I can click. Let's use all. I did not get any grass gear, just trash, including this tree cloak. So let's equip it. How do I upgrade? I guess I need another stick and then I can get a better weapon, this bow. I'm gonna get so much more damage if I ever get that. All right, but I got some more gems here. What I'm gonna do is watch another ad, get some more gems. Give me the money. We got 10, stupid scamming game. And I also got a crap reward another dumb cloak but my chest is now level two i don't know what that's gonna do let's go fight the boss i'm probably gonna one shot him it is a purple velociraptor oh yeah get out of here oh i'm gonna get a poop or something it's got like a green gummy bear in it what's that smell it's a huge pile of poop oh my gosh well we just destroyed him we got 17 donuts and now there's another dinosaur i guess i'm a dead man now please grant me strength god says okay <laughs> thank you god well we got thor's might i can now use it during boss fights i guess that's kind of cool how much damage oh well i'm still one shotting all of these dinosaurs because i love leveled up so much. I can also claim rewards from these quests. This is really nice. We're going to open a bunch of chests after this. I have 140 gems, so let's purchase 10 of them. Here we go. Oh, yes. Good. Uh-huh. Tier 3. We got two tier 3 items. Well, that's amazing. I think we should equip them. We got a tier 2 breastplate, so let's equip that. We also have tier 2 pants, so we're going to equip that. Tier 2 gloves. Where's my tier 3 stuff? Oh, here we go. Tier 3 shoulders. That's going to give me a lot more strength. 3.5 thousand be exact. I can also upgrade my cloak. So it's now tier two. And then I got my tier three chick helmet, whatever that means. I guess I'm wearing a dead chick on my head, but I don't have a better weapon. I still have this crappy one. Now look at my guy. He's ready for battle. Get bonked. This is the power I need for the next boss. And this is what I currently have. We have about 20 times more. So we're probably actually going to one shot the boss. Here we go. Ready? Bam. Oh no. Sorry. We two shot at him. Yeah. Ooh, I'm ready to travel. Here we go. We're going to the next area, the uh, continent of Splendor, I guess. You can study mechanical engineering to build turrets. Turrets will automatically attack enemies. That sounds fun. Wait, what's happening? Oh, I just got a bunch of gems. Oh, click that. Okay. There's a lot more stuff on my screen now, including this turret over here, and it wants me to level them up. So let's go ahead and do that. Cost one stone to level. Well, let's just put all of them into it. Go auto clicker, do your thing. I love how loud it is. So now I can just let the game play for itself. I don't need my auto clicker. The next boss, I need 2.5 thousand damage. I have 28.1, so let's go destroy him. It's a really weird, sussy mirror cat. He doesn't do any damage to me, so I'm just gonna bonk him in the head a few times, and he's dead. Oh, hey, God, I'm so touched by your will to survive. I decided to give you a gift. Well, thank you. <gasps> a turret part chest. Okay, what do I get? I got a helmet. What do I do with that? So I can equip it onto my turret. So now my turret has 599 engineering. I don't know what that means, but I'm sure it's pretty neat. Probably gives him more damage. Ooh, I just got another gem bag. How much does that give me? Only five? Come on, give me more. Ooh, it's increasing. I just keep getting all these gem bags. I don't, I don't know why, actually. So apparently, I can get three 300 bags every day. That's a lot of gems because each bag has five gems. Look, they just keep showing up. I love it. And my weapon sucks. So what I want to do is purchase 100 gear chests once again. So here we go. Give me a good weapon. And we got another stupid stick. We're not happy about that. But I think that means I can actually upgrade the stick. Yes, I can. We're going to go from 225 strength to 1.4 thousand. So let's upgrade. And we now have a bow. I also got boots finally. So my toes aren't going to be cold. Just kidding. My toes are still exposed. But now I sit back here and I shoot air arrows repeatedly <laughs> over and over again. Tree cloak gear. Why did I get that? I guess that's pretty neat, but let's go battle the boss. It says I need 3,300 combat power, but I have 31,000. So let's do battle and launch these arrows into his face and he's dead instantly. Stage seven is completed. I've unlocked events. They give me a free gems just for playing the game. You, you uh, love to see it. This whole list is just giving me tons of free gems. Look at this dense jungle. Ooh, <gasps> what's that? Click it. Special reward. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to pick the Antarctica flag and then we get 10 gems. I also one shot these new uh, creatures. I don't know what they are, but we're going to wipe them out, make them extinct. They're called an Entolodont. 
Okay, with my 240 gems, what do you say we purchase another 10 chests? I think so, because I want a better weapon. Give me some luck. Ooh, tier three boots. Very nice. So let's equip them, the chick shoes. It's gonna take us from 159 strength to 2.7 thousand. That sounds good. I haven't leveled up in a long time, so let's go ahead and do that. Spend all my donuts. We're now level 149. And what's in my bag? Three gear chests. Let's use all of them. Here we go. Wow, that's trash. We've pretty much wiped out the population of whatever these are called. So let's go fight the boss. I have more than enough combat power. It's looking a bit fancy, but my arrows are, yeah, he's just no match for me. Next up is a bird. This is an endangered species and I'm killing it in one shot. So I'm pretty much wiping out the population of every single animal on this island wherever I am. And when I get Goku's power, I kill even more. It's great. I'm going to take myself to level 150 and then I'm going to level up the turret as well because I haven't been leveling it up at all. It's now at level, what is it? 100 exactly. And then we click this and we get more stones. Ooh, we just got a thousand stones from that. So let's spend them. A pile of sticks is now level 107. It's actually doing a lot of damage. It's killing things on its own in three hits. Let's purchase 100 turret chests. Make our turret much stronger. Ooh, we got tier two and everything else is garbage. But we can at least equip something in every single slot. So let's equip the tree part C and then uh, this ball of sticks, I guess. And then a tier two cannon. So now our turret looks like a weird creature. I can't really see it on the screen, but this is what it looks like. It's so strong now. It's killing these endangered birds in one shot. So it's time to go fight the boss. Definitely a lot stronger. Now that is a scary bird. I'm not even clicking. My turret is doing all the damage. That's pretty amazing. Wait, what is this in the background? Ooh, 99 cents for all these chests. I think so. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead and use all of them at once. All 20. This is gonna be awesome. Give me like a tier 20. Here we go. Oh, I got a tier five. <gasps> tier six. Is that a tier six helmet? Oh my gosh. We got cotton candy tier four and then a tier six something or other. I can't wait to see what this says. A tier six helmet. 88,000 strength. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that's a big bag, by the way. All right. Well, we're gonna go from 3,000 strength to, yeah, 88,000 just by equipping this new helmet. That's pretty crazy. I also look crazy. We also got uh, the cotton candy pauldron. So that's a lot more strength there. And then we got tier three gloves. So my character is much, much stronger now. I'm probably going to one shot everything for a very long time. But before we fight more bosses, let's open 20 turret chests. Here we go. Uh, we didn't get anything good. Just a bunch of tier two crap. But that's okay. Let's equip all of them. So even my turret is one-shotting these dinosaurs now. Yeah, let's just uh, start speedrunning this game. What do you say? I have 241,000 power now. That helmet is pretty good. I'm gonna let my turret finish this boss off. Goodbye. Well, folks, we've annihilated all of the animals in this area of the island. So we are now moving forward and we're killing sea stars. These are very rare creatures. The, the local population will no longer exist. I'm still one-shotting everything. I can go to a village. Let's go check it out. Ooh, there's a portal, a smithy. I can craft gear. I can upgrade everything. Okay, let's upgrade all. And we just got a dumb bow. So look at this. Because I spent 99 cents for 20 chests, I get 25 more. Okay, that's a very nice reward. So what do you say we open all ooh, 26 of them? Let's see if I get some more tier six material. The answer is no. I get crap. Well, let's try this uh, turret chest. Oh, well, we got some tier three. That's pretty good, I guess. I'm guessing this tier six helmet is really rare. So we got like super lucky. All right, let's go find the boss. I have 252,000 power. And he's dead instantly. I haven't leveled up in a long time, so it's, it's time to do that. I'm now level 183. I'm killing very cute sea otters. I feel really bad about this. They're one of my favorite animals. They're so cute and snuggly. Well, I don't want to wipe out every single sea otter on this island, so let's go do the boss. Ooh, look how beautiful he looks. <laughs> Wait, what exactly is this? I just want to look at him because, um, okay, he's dead. My turret wiped him out. The next creature is a pink elephant. Of course, we're one-shotting everything still. If I want to research chick, I need to get my turret to level 183. So let's start leveling it up. And because I don't want people to report me for murdering endangered animals, let's go fight the elephant boss. Well, he's got a red eye. I, I guess he's not a morning person and now he's dead. Next up is a rare dinosaur bird. You don't see these too often in the wild. But let's keep killing bosses until we get to a point where everything's just too strong for me. Die, you stupid bird. And it's dead. Next up is the very rare triceratops. I've only seen about three in my whole life. And just like that, I've already killed about 20 of them. So let's go fight the Triceratops boss. The father Triceratops. He takes about three arrows and is dead. Okay, well, the population has been wiped out. We're now moving to the Arctic. I can now build a hut. 
Apparently the hut lets me recover HP, but we're not taking any damage because we kill everything in about five seconds. So let's just focus on killing the penguin population, which actually does make me sad because penguins are my favorite animal. So let's quickly eliminate the emperor penguin boss. We're getting a little bit stronger, but he's still dead in about two seconds. Oh, look, I'm not killing him in one hit. This is like, this is a good sign. We're getting to a point in the game where I might actually have to play it or grind rather. Here is the armadillo boss. Let's quickly take him out. And now we have walruses to murder. Let's see if we can take our turret to level 183 the answer is yes so i can now research the chick yay that enhanced all of my stats it's pretty good what do you say we purchase another 10 gear chest we have 430 gems so let's see what happens and we get a bunch of tier 2 and tier 3 items so our chests are getting better we can upgrade our little grass skirt here so that makes us a little bit stronger oh, we can also upgrade our weapon oh we're gonna get a mace well 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 back to melee combat yeah <laughs> smack him in the head with it stupid walrus all right let's take down the walrus boss it's a little bit stronger but still dies really quickly next up we have a a Demetrodon. I don't think they like getting smashed in the face by a mace. So let's just move on to the boss. This is what it looks like. It's very cute and beautiful, but it's now dead and I'm going to eat it. So if I want to get to the next civilization, everything needs to be at least level 300. Currently my hut is level 2. Ooh, I can equip something. Oh, a stick. Okay. So now I at least won't get soaked during the rain. Okay, so let's start leveling this up. Yeah, this is going to take a little while. Okay, it's now level 181. So pretty much on par with my uh, idiot warrior here who's bald still. Don't let his helmet fool you. What do you say we try to get a tier 6 weapon get really lucky? Let's see what happens. That's not it. Tier 1 trash. Let's try again. Okay, it's just giving me complete garbage now. Come on. Oh, we got two tier 3 maces or ball and chain, whatever you want to call them. I think that means I can actually upgrade it. Why, yes, I can. Just kidding. We need the rabbit civilization. So why am I able to use this then? Because this is the crow civilization. I guess if you get it in the chest, you're able to actually use it. Well, then let's open some more chests. Come Come on now, give me something good. I'm gonna spend all my gems on the gear chest here because I want a better weapon. And the last ones. Okay, come on. I'm now out of gems. I got scammed. Well, let's go fight the boss. He might knock me with his tail, but we're gonna kill him. He's uh, they're definitely getting a lot stronger though. And we murdered everything in the Arctic. Let's move on to the volcano. There's a bag here. Do I get something? I don't know, but these little guys are really cute. I'm still killing them really quickly. And you know, we love to murder on this channel. Well, I can upgrade my skirt to tier three. There we go. My turret is now a chick. You can see See it's shooting eggs. Let's fight the boss. I'm still a lot stronger than the bosses, but it is getting to the point where it's starting to take at least four clicks. We are now fighting these little dragonfly thingies. I've never seen anything like that. It's probably really endangered, but I'm ruining the population. So let's go fight the boss. Make sure they never breed. Here it is. It's doing a little bit of damage, but it's now dead. It'll never make any babies. And now we're fighting wolves. So I'm just going to sit here and kill a million wolves, and then we'll see how much money I have. 